So Occupy Wall Street happened five years ago right here. It's five years later and it's 9.30 p.m. Why are people still here? Can we talk to you for can we talk to you for a little bit? Get the fuck out of here. Don't don't interfere with us, okay? Now go. I'm just trying to I'm just trying to help go, you fight go, the go. man. Right now it's totally corrupt time, dark time. Obviously baloney is running the day. We got Orange Hitler versus the White Queen and you know, we're forced to choose. What do you normally do on Saturday nights? This? Uh, this is more fun than usual. Oh yeah, all right. Any of you guys wanna say hi? When he wins, he's gonna turn his place into a fucking Gestapo. So you've been growing that dread since two, since five years ago? I have not cut my hair. When I was here at Zuccotti Park, I yeah, this was I had just enough hair from a male pattern sort of ogre cut to pull my hair into a top knot, just like this, five years ago. I haven't looked back since. <laughs> Good people here. The election that's coming up this year, it's like one of like the most craziest elections I ever saw. It's like kind of like outrageous. Hi, how are you? Hello, how are you? Saturday night, big night of the week, big party night. You guys are all here. Why do you think this is like so important? Well, I don't, I don't really buy into the whole Friday night is, is a different night than Monday night and all that. It's kind of all one, one being here now kind of day for me. Yeah. How did you find out about this party? Uh, well, I planned on coming for three days and I'm still here five years later. So. You know how Ross and Rachel were on a break? Does that matter or is Ross still an asshole? I mean, I think they're also assholes, so it's yeah. like, you know. I'm going to meet a husband here. I'm not leaving until I meet a husband. If everybody here more or less hates the Chinese and the Russians, guess what's going to happen? A war. And not just a war, but World War number what? Hello? Three. I have a philosophical question for you. So Ross and Rachel were on a break. Does that matter? Can she still be upset? It's actually endemic of kind of the Occupy paradigm that Occupy is kind of viewed by all these people who are kind of hemming and hawing around the outside and going, oh, I don't think I'll get involved or I'd rather make fun of them. When actually, if Ross had just been up front from the get-go, you know, we wouldn't have had a series. There wouldn't have been any dynamic tension. Five years later, Occupy Wall Street is still as important as ever.